Can you imagine what they taste like cooked? It's... Have you heard about uh, Mudfuna before? Mudfuna? Yes, that's it's what like I'm trying to do now. It's like a... A Berber pizza. A Berber pizza. Yes. <laughs> My newfound friend, Brahim, gives me a masterclass on how the Berbers cook pizza in the mountains. Spoiler alert, it's a bit different from Domino's. You use the most expensive mushrooms in the world. Abdullah. Magic. The top of quality. This is a dream for me, Abdullah. I love you. Oh. <laughs> we'll put the bocchini in first. We'll put the Giron here. And then we'll put the morel. And then trumpet, some onions, and garlic. Ras al hanout is a mix of spices widely used in Moroccan cuisine. Ah, oh, perfect. Bread. I saw this on my visit in the Medina. Yeah, it's got a nice and flat. Now I'm starting to understand what Najet was explaining. Get closer to the Berbers, understand what the village is doing. Oh. Mushrooms in. Look at those. Now, goat cheese. Wow, this is getting better and better and better. So goat cheese is going to give it its saltiness, right? Nice. It's a very nice combination. It's yeah? a beautiful combination. <laughs> now for the lid. That goes on top. Back on. The Berbers, they like uh, making this. Most of them are nomads. They live in the mountains. Yeah. And uh, the mushrooms are everywhere, you know? What a treat. Take some. Olive branches. Right. So it's cooking the bottom, from the bottom the top. and the top, yeah. Yes. Amazing. Yes. And warming us up. And keeping us warm, yeah. yeah. I've repelled for them, I've swam for them. Ooh. And now it's finally time to eat these precious wow. mushrooms. Abdullah. Look at that. <laughs> really beautiful.